welcome students in my new tutorial and in this i'll be teaching you how to use shape twin so i'll be clicking upon action script 3.0 from here and now as usual from here i'll select fit in window so that i am able to see the whole canvas and now I'll select any random shape. Suppose I'm just taking oval shape and whatever are the default colors, I'll take that only and I'll make one shape in center. Let it be oval shape and I'll make it in center somewhere to here. Double clicking so that whole shape can be selected. And then what I'll do, I'll go somewhere here. Suppose it is written 50, 50th frame. And now here I will click upon modify and here I will click upon timeline and here is the option of convert to blank keyframe. The keyboard shortcut is F7. Now this time I have not to make any keyframe. I have to make blank keyframe. So I'll click upon this blank keyframe and as I click upon blank keyframe here, you will see this will be vanished. It will go. So it's not gone actually, it is here. If I'll move my cursor back in the timeline. So when I'll move it towards 50th, now this is the blank keyframe. So it will not show you the previous shape. Now I'll make some new shape. Suppose I want to create a star, click on options, star, this time I want to do some changes, number of sides suppose 7 and point size, I am just making it to 0.25, okay, and then color I am changing, uh, suppose this color I want to make, and now I am making one star, now this star, it's different, and I will try to arrange it somewhere here. Now, I want to use shape twin. That shape twin means changing from one shape into another. So, simply I can click anywhere and then the option is uh, insert. Now, you could see here create shape twin. If I will click it here, you could see that it is changing. If I'll press control enter, it's changing in this way. But something is missing. Because firstly, it should show for a while as a circle. So for that, what I'll do, I'll press control Z. So that I am back. Okay, again, control Z. Just to remove the tween, shape tween. And what I'll do, till frame 10 i want that it should be shown as a circle only so when i am on frame 10 i can click on uh, modify timeline and then i can click on convert to keyframe now whatever at the present its shape is or it which place it is it will show in the same way so till 10 I want that it should remain like this and then the transformation takes from keyframe number 10 that means frame number 10. Now I just made it as a keyframe so that its shape should be same. Now from here I want to convert. So now you can click on insert and shape twin. So you could see here from frame number 1 to frame number 10 the shape will not be changed and from frame number 10 to frame number 50 it's changed after 50 also it should remain for a while why because if i press control enter you could see and again the star is not remaining for a while it should remain as a star for a while circle remains so what i could do again i can make one new keyframe I'll click upon 60 for 10 seconds. Uh, it's not 10 seconds, 10 frames. So I can right click it here also, insert keyframe. F6 is the keyboard shortcut. 
So now once the keyframe is been added, now if I want to change it, I'll press Control Enter. I want to suppose I want to run it. You could see here now it's stopping. So I hope you have understood how to use shape twin. Just try this and after you have tried, just try to expand these shapes. Now once you have tried, now I want to try some new shape in this. Again, I can click, suppose uh, I want on 90th keyframe, 90th frame, I can right click from here also I can do, either I can click from here and I can press insert blank keyframe till here the star is and from here nothing is shown because it's blank now i can take some new shape so this time i can take a rectangle color i can change suppose red i want to take and this i want to take blue I can rearrange it, sorry it was not selected, I can double click it just to select whole and then rest of the process you know what to do, click on insert and shape twin, the same way at last suppose on 100 frame I can click on insert insert keyframe so now if I want to run this control enter from the starting firstly circle star and then rectangle so you have learned how to use different shapes and how to change between different shapes I hope you will like these animations basic animations so with this I am closing my this tutorial and if you like my explanation then please do like share and comment and also subscribe my channel if you have not subscribed it earlier. Okay bye bye take care meet you soon in my next tutorial.